this is Mrs. Greco's classroom. We are going to talk about questions and today is Thursday the 6th of 2000. What do you do at school? Anne? Um, today we're learning about dinosaurs. Anything else? And Molly? What kind of math? Well, like, pluses, minus, and um, what are pluses, minus, and we learn about dinosaurs. Jessica? Um, we, uh, we do that, we do spelling. We have what kind of words do you do in spelling? We do, like, louder. David? In math, we're learning about how to tell time. Okay. Elizabeth? Um, we do science and we're trying to make things in a stable position. Anyone else? What do you do at school? Michael? We're learning about what dinosaurs eat and how they protect themselves. Good. How do they protect themselves? Well, I think the T-Rex protects itself by its tail. Andrew? We learn about the states and other What was that last part? Jessica, nice and loud. Um, we do centers. We do centers and um, centers is like we take a tab and um, put it to some, um, whatever you want it, but stickers and you said that so much people um, to go on the center. And um, not quite finished file, we have, if you don't have a not quite finished file, you have to um, have a not quite finished file. Good. Last one, Andrew, go ahead. <laughs> Louder, sweetie. We do uh, writing and math. We um, learn what the plan is the solar system. Great. Next question. What do you do at recess? Jarrett, what do you do? I play hockey at recess. Yeah? Who do you play with? AJ, what do you do? I do um, hockey, and I play with Jordan, Alex, um, and some first graders, and Jared, and I play soccer. All right. Shannon, what do you do? Uh, I play with Anne Marie. What do you play? Um, I don't know. You don't know? Okay. Michael, what do you do? I really, really like dinosaurs and at recess. I play dinosaurs. How do you play dinosaurs? Well, that thing outside has all those bars. Some people are inside it and you try to get them. Cool. So it's kind of like Chase? A little Except bit? Your dinosaurs. Cool. Charlie, what do you do? I play Pokemon with my friends. How do you play Pokemon? Cool. Is it fun? Yeah. Kevin? Um, I, I usually play in swings with Jessica and Molly, and we swing, swing each other up really high, and we start going really fast. It's like really fun. Like, like around and around. And one time, um, and then um, sometimes I skate around, and then you walk around, and then 
You bumped them on accident? Oh, that happens sometimes. Who did? Kevin, who else played with you? Charlie. Oh, cool. Alex, what do you do? Um, I play tag. Yeah? How do you play tag? <laughs> <laughs> That's easy. Do you just chase each other? Yeah. Okay. Somebody's it. See, Ann, what do you do? Um, I play with my friend Mary and Shannon, and we usually play puppies. How do you play puppies? And pretend we're puppies and by the rocks in the sewer we pretend that's a little doggy house. Aww. Andrew. Um, when we have indoor recess sometimes, um, I play the computer and uh, Andrew plays with his computer and other stuff on the computer. Cool. David, what do you play? It's like teamwork tag. Yeah, is it fun? Yeah. Yeah, Alex, do you like playing that too? Yeah. Yeah, so everyone has to be kept away from you, huh? Uh -huh. No, um, no. There's like some people who try to keep Alex safe, and there's like one or two people who try to, um, tag Alex or get to him, and it's usually me and Alex who try to get to him. Yeah. Fun. Fun. Reed, what do you play at recess? You play in the playground? What's your favorite part? What's my favorite part? Uh, Do you like the slide, the swings, the hill? Everything. Everything. He likes everything. Great. All right, Colleen, what do you do? I play with my friends. Yeah. My friends' names are... And what do you play? We play like we're getting these boys and like Lauren and Jenna and other people from Mrs. Cooper's class. And Umbria. Yeah, Umbria. What do you, and you have to try to get the boys? Do you chase them? Yeah. Yeah? yeah? Do the boys like to be chased? Yes. Yeah? And Who? sometimes this boy, when we get him like the coat, he like takes his coat off and he just puts it on. Yeah? So you're stuck with this coat, but you don't catch him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. Thank you, Colleen. Yeah. Molly, what do you do? Um, sometimes we, we play with, um, I play with Charlie, Kevin, and Andrew. And sometimes we play, um, sometimes um, when I'm not playing with them, me, Jenna, Elizabeth, and Lauren, um, we pretend like we're like at the Santa thing, and like there's a reindeer, and I'm like the person who feeds them and brushes them and watches them. And I get them ready for Santa's sleigh, but we didn't get Santa yet. Well, that sounds like fun. That'd be neat. Thank you. What is your favorite thing to eat? And why don't we just start at the top and go all the way so everyone can share. Jessica, what's your favorite thing to eat? Uh, my favorite thing to eat is um, Chinese noodles. Chinese noodles? Shane? Macaroni? Oh, mashed potatoes. Yummy. All right, Lauren. Um, Steak. Ooh, yummy. Uh, David. Grapes. Where'd you go? Grapes? Yeah, your favorite? Yummy. Uh, Brienne. My favorite food is spaghetti. Yeah? With meatballs? Or just spaghetti? Yeah. Yummy.
Jarrett. Um, broccoli. Broccoli, really? It's your favorite? Yeah. Wow. Um, Elizabeth. Um, Oreo. Oreos, double stuff? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Yep, I am going in order, so you can put your hands on if you'd like. Um, Anne. Tomatoes and croutons. Tomatoes and croutons. Do you like the tomatoes cooked? No. Just raw? Yummy. Um, Jack. My favorite thing is to eat is ribs. Yum. Ribs? Michael. Oh, yeah. Pizza and ribs and fries. All together? Wow. No, just like, um, like those are my three favorite things. Yum. All right, Adam. My favorite thing to eat is pizza. Yeah, what do you like on top of your pizza? Um, pepperoni. Just pepperoni? Do you like a lot of cheese? Yeah. Yeah? All right, um, Adrian. Yep. Yep. I pizza and spaghetti. Pizza and spaghetti. Andrea. You didn't forget. What is your favorite thing to eat? Or, or just one thing that you like to eat? How about I go to Colleen and come back to you? Okay. okay. Colleen. My favorite food is pork chops, carrots, and gorillas. Ooh, yummy. What's your favorite, Andrea? Um, watermelon. What is it? Watermelon. 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 Yum. Yummy. All right, uh, Jenna. My favorite food is ice cream, corn on the cob, and um, strawberries. Ice cream, corn on the cob, and strawberries. Yummy. Okay, uh, Reed. What's your favorite food, Reed? Watching cookies. Ooh, yummy. Okay, um, Kevin. Kevin. My favorite is corn on the cob. Yeah, yum. Shannon. Um, my favorite food is, um, Oreos and pizza. Yum. Okay, Charlie. My favorite is watermelon and pizza. Watermelon, not watermelon on your pizza. Ew. <laughs> Good, just separate, right? Yum. That sounds yummy. Charlie, what do you like on your pizza? Just plain or sometimes with pepperonis. Yeah, yummy. I love Alex. The mashed potatoes. Yeah. Do you like anything on your mashed potatoes? Not gravy. Gravy, yeah. Um, we are to Andrew. Where is Andrew? There he is. I like pizza with cheese and sauce. With cheese and sauce? Yum. Uh, Molly. What's your favorite? Pizza, ice cream, mashed potatoes with gravy, and Caesar salad. What do you like on your pizza? Ham, bacon, and pineapple, or mm. sometimes just cheese. Yummy. And AJ. What do you like to eat? Potatoes and gravy on Yum. Yum. Mrs. Zakovich, what do you like to eat? Oh, I like anything Mexican. I like Mexican. Ooh, yummy. This question is, what do you collect? What do you collect? Kevin, what do you collect? I collect Beanie Babies. Beanie Babies? Raise your hand if you collect Beanie Babies, too. I have more than 100. Yeah? You collect Beanie Babies? What else? What's something else that you collect? Uh, Charlie? Raise your hand if you collect Pokemon cards. Raise your, raise your hand if you have a lot of Pokemon cards. Yeah. What's something else you collect? Adam, what do you collect? Hockey cards. Is there anyone else that collects hockey cards? Yeah. A lot of people collect hockey cards. Someone else, something else that you collect. What do you collect, Andrea? Um, I collect American dolls. American dolls. Raise your hand if you collect American dolls. I only have one. Yeah. That's all right. What's something else you collect? Michael, what do you collect? I collect rocks. Rocks? Yeah, do you have a lot of rocks? Raise your hand if you collect rocks. Michael, are they, are they special rocks? Yeah. What makes them special? Because some look like, like price for the animals and, and some are really cool rocks. Cool. Hey, what's something else you collect? Colleen, what do you collect? Candy. Does it last a while? Yeah, you save it? Wow. Anyone else collect candy? I think everyone else eats candy. <laughs> I eat candy. I do. 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 I do.
collect? What's some, what's something else you collect? Uh, Anyone else have something? Anne, what do you collect? Barbies. Barbies. Raise your hand if you collect Barbies. Yeah. <laughs> Jared, that's a cute face to look at in 25 years. That'll be cute. Anyone else collect something? Uh, Andrew, what do you collect? Um, I want to collect dinosaurs. <laughs> it's kind of hard to collect dinosaurs, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Get toy yeah well, you know what? Maybe when you grow up, you could collect dinosaur bones. That'd be cool. AJ, what do you collect? I collect um, little pieces of silver, um, 50 pieces. Oh, silver dollars or half dollars? Oh, do you have a lot? Yeah. Wow, great. The question is, what is something that inspires you or something that interests you a lot? Elizabeth? You like spelling books? And what does that make you want to do? Do it spelling? Makes me practice my spelling? Fun. Michael, what inspires you? Dinosaurs. Yeah? What is it? What do you want to do with dinosaurs? Dig up their bones and. Identify dinosaurs. Very good. What inspires you, Jarrett? PlayStation. <laughs> yeah? Yeah? That interests you a lot? Yeah, because it makes me want to play it because I have a new PlayStation game called Spyro 2, and I beat it twice already. It's, it's too easy for me. Yeah. I like it so much. Cool. Kevin, what inspires you? Nintendo 64. What's your favorite game? Pokemon Snap. Yeah? Are you good at it? Yeah, I'm pretty good. My friend Luke beat the game for me, though. Yeah. It's a big Cool. Um, Molly, what inspires you? Um, sometimes when I go to a friend's house and play my Game Boy. Yeah. What do you play on your Game Boy? Well, I have this ocean discovery thing with Barbie and a Pokemon, a Pokemon pinball. And I have, um, it was, um, I forgot what it was called. It was a Rugrats Time trivia. Fun. Jessica, what interests you? <coughs> yeah. How about um? Because we got about like twelve PlayStation games, and we had it this last Christmas. We had this fighting game this Christmas, the Tiki Two, and I haven't played it before, and I beat this. But like, well, all we do, me and Kevin, all we do is like, rub our hands on the buttons and we do certain tricks. <laughs> yeah, you can but do the tricks. We have to, we have to do uh, certain things. Wait for the person to get up before you tackle. Okay, great. Let's try something something other than a video game. What's something other than a video game that inspires you? David, what inspires you? Reading. Yeah? What's your favorite book? Um Yeah? The Invisible Dog? Great. Charlie, what inspires you? Turtles. Yeah, what do you, would you like to learn more about turtles? Yeah. Shannon, what inspires you? Um, Barbies. How do they inspire you? Um, I like to play them a lot, and um, I collect them. Yeah. And what inspires you? I have a couple of things. Puppies, Barbies, and my Pokemon Magic. Oh. Lauren, what inspires you? American Dog Girls. What? American Dog Girls. You're very interested in those? Yeah. yeah. Do you read the books? No, do I don't have a Yeah, something to think about. Adrian, what inspires you? Um, writing. writing? Would you like to be a writer? Yeah, what do you like to write about? Um, <coughs> Who's that? Everybody. Oh, that's nice. Andrew, what inspires you? Um, jokes. Yeah? Brianne, what inspires you? Animals. Colleen? Uh, yeah? How long have you been playing? I haven't played at all, but I have a little computer. I'm going to make up my own 
You play on the com the piano through the computer? And I play Wow, that's neat. Alex, what inspires you? Tennis. Yeah? Do you take tennis lessons? I used to. Yeah, you enjoy that? Jack, what inspires you? Soccer. Yeah? Are you a good soccer player? Yes. What's the trick to being a good soccer player, Jack? Do not take your hands on the ball. Just use your hands on the ball. Keep your hands off the ball, huh? And keep your eye on the ball if you take your hands. Very good. That's good advice. AJ, what inspires you? Yeah? Are you good on the skateboard? Yeah. Yeah? What kind of tricks can you do? I can do a... Um, I can... I can do... I don't know what they're called, but I can do them. Tell us about it. Just ex describe one. Four sixty. I can do a four sixty. What does that look like? Yeah, cool. Anyone else? A Andrea, what inspires you? Um, puppies. Puppies? Yeah. Now, about our families. Andrea, what do you want to say? What was your dog's name? Sarge. Yeah. Brienne? I like my brother Daniel. I like two brothers. And I miss my old dog Would you like any other pets? I like Jared and I like Jared. Yeah. Jared? What are we oh, talking oh. about family? Tell me about your family. Yeah, Adrian. A twin sister. Really? Do anything else you want to say about your family? Yeah. He liked to ride his motorcycle, didn't he? Yeah. Elizabeth, what about your family? Um, I like them because they give me um, lots of stuff that I need. And they, and they gave me a big house so that I can... AJ, what about your family? How big is your chick now? She died. She died. She died. Her That's right. That's right. Colleen? I like my family because my family loves me and because my dog's there to protect me when I'm home. And sometimes we'll just get home. Sometimes we we'll just get home. Yeah, that's your dog. Yeah. Aww. Andrea, tell me about your family. Um, my my mom buys me whatever I want, and um, I had four dogs and um, five puppies, but they all died. Yeah. 
And tell me about your family. Uh, I like my, I love my mom, dad, sister, and my goldfish and my crayfish because they all love me and they help me live and survive. Okay. Your goldfish helps you survive? Yeah, because that, that makes me laugh when my mom and dad tease me about it. Oh, that's cute. Anyone else want to say anything? Jessica? Uh, I have a brother, mom, a dad, a sister, and their names. It's a brother, and he's nine years old. He's turning 10 this year. And he's in fourth grade. Uh, my daddy is 41. Um, and he's at a college. My mom is 41, and she's at a college. And they're each turning 42 this year. And my sister is 12. Oh, she already turned 12, and she will be turning 13 till next year. And she's in sixth grade. Thank you, Jessica. Michael? I have a mom, dad, and a sister, and I love them. And when it's my birthday, my mom lets me go to Toys R Us and buy anything I want. Cool. Molly. Uh, I have a mom, a dad, my dog Ruby, my sister Michelle, my sister Megan, and I like my cousin Jessica and my aunt Vicky, but and I really miss my uncle Bobby. <coughs> Special, huh?
now we are going to tell you what we want to do when we grow up. I want to be a paleontologist because I want to learn about dinosaurs and how they live and what their bones look like. Alright. Shane. Alright. Shane. What would you like to be when you grow up? What would you like to be when you grow up? If he doesn't want to, he doesn't have to. Shane, what would you like to be when you grow up? A what? You forgot? What do you think? Huh? You don't know? Okay, I'll come back to you, okay? Alright. Number three, Lauren. Stand up, Lauren. I'm going to come back to you, Lauren, okay? David? Um, Stand up, sweetie. When I grow up, I want to be an engineer. What? Why? Because um, my dad is one. Okay. All right, uh, three in. I want to be a cheerleader. Yeah. Jarrett, what would you like to be? I want to work for the Pokemon. What? I can't hear you. I want to work for the Pokemon factory when I grow up. Give my kids all the Pokemon cards in the <laughs> So what kind of things would you make other than Pokemon cards? Um, I would make, um, I would make Pokemon movies. Sarah, 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 Sarah. Cool. All set? Dinosaur movies, facts about dinosaurs on books. Cool. So you want to be an author too. All right, very good. Number seven, Elizabeth. Where is she? I want to be a scientist. What kind of scientist? Um, a scientist about the stars. Ooh. Great. You like um, learning about outer space? Of course not, Reed. Not yet. Good. Not your turn yet. Number eight, Ian, what would you like to be? I want to be a teacher when I go. Why? Because I like teachers. Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, Jack. I would like to be... I would like to be an architect. Ooh, an, an architect? Cool. That'd be awesome. Architect is someone who designs buildings. All right, Michael. What would you like to be when you grow up? A dentist. A dentist? How come? Because they make a lot of money and they get time off. When I grow up, I want to be um, an astronaut. How come? Okay. You like the to study about stars and things? Great. All right, Adrian. I want to be a halo. Why? Okay. Andrea. I want to be a singer when I grow up. Why? Because I like to sing. You want to sing for us right now? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that, that put you on the spot, didn't it? <laughs> um, Col not Colleen. Uh, yeah, Colleen. Colleen's turn. I want to be a teacher. Why, Colleen? Because I can bust everybody. <gasps> <up>. <laughs> okay. Like <a> okay. <laughs> because then she can boss everyone around. <laughs> Colleen, you're funny. All right. Um, Jenna. Mom that you don't that um, works at home, like um, 
and um, I, to spend, I wanna because why? Because I wanna spend a time with my kids. That is wonderful. Be a hockey addict. Why, Reed? Because I wanna study about phones and. The dinosaur bones? And I also want to study about fossils. Very good. Thank you, Reed. You'd be a good scientist. All right, Kevin. I want to be a roller coaster designer because I like roller coasters a lot. Great. And Shannon. <laughs> When I grow up, I want to be three things. I want to be a mom that works at home, and I want to be a teacher, and I want to be a hairdresser. Very good. Any one of those that you like the best? No. Oh, you like all of them. Mm -hmm. um, Charlie. I want to be a soccer player because I'm good at soccer, and Jared, when I was the goalie, he almost got like only like once a goal on me. Wow, that's great. Great, very great. Alex. I want to be a hockey player. Why? I don't know. Hockey fun? Are you good at it? Yeah. Ice hockey? Yeah. Cool. And Andrew. I want to be a hockey player um, so that I can be um, like really good at hockey. And I want to be a scientist to study about um, states. Wow, lots of things. Very good. And Molly. Uh, I want to be two things. Well, actually, it's right here. Um, I want to be a mom who babysits sometimes, like grandma, and I want to be a teacher. Why? Well, why I want to be a teacher is because I like teachers and I play teacher at my, home, my house. And why I want to be a mom is because I want to have children. Why I want to be like my mom and be like a babysitter um, is because I like babysitting for my cousins. Very good. What are your cousins' names? Um, I have one little cousin that sometimes I watch while my, my aunt is downstairs or something. I watch her and she's one year old and her name is Jessica. Great. And AJ. Why? You don't know why? You just like what they do? You want to drive around in a police car? Great. Good. All right, Shane, we are back to you. Shane, what would you like to be when you grow up? Yeah, do you like to play football? Yeah. Yeah, are you good at it? Do you want to be one of the runners or you want to be one of the tacklers? Do you like to run? Yeah. Sounds good, Shane. Thank you. And Lauren. When I go, I like to be a teacher. Yeah, why? I don't know. You don't know? Okay. Talk about our favorite movie. Jenna. Uh, my favorite movie is Mary Kate and Ashley Postman. Elizabeth? My favorite movie is Stuart Little. Reed? Adam? My favorite movie is Why? I couldn't hear her. Hear him. What was yours? Toy Story 2. Very good. Michael? My favorite movie is um, Stuart Little and Toy Story 2. Very good. AJ? Um, Saving Private Ryan. Jessica? What was the second one? Dr. Brianne? My favorite movie is... I've never seen that movie. What? David? <laughs> My favorite movie is World Geographic's 1990, Best of 1990. Great. 
Kevin. Um, my favorite movie is Swabu and Dr. Doolittle. Andrea. Um, I got two of them. Go ahead and tell us. Um, my first one is, um, I forgot. You forgot. We'll come back to you. Andrew? Um, my favorite movies are, um, Bicentennial Man and, um, Flubber. Jared? Oh, my favorite movie is Stuart Little and my best friend's wedding. Very good. Andrea? Um, my, my first one is Stuart Little. My second one is It. It? Oh my goodness, that's scary. Oh my. Ian? My favorite movie is The Rugrats, first movie. Shannon? Oh. My favorite movies are um, any Mary Kate and Ashley videos, or um, um, Flubber or Toy Story 2. Great. Molly? My favorite movies are all the Jurassic Parks, The Mummy, um, Toy Story 2, and Short Little. Very good. Colleen? Um, my favorite movie is my favorite Martian and Aladdin. Very good. Adrian. My favorite movies Hello and uh, Great. Molly? The Bachelor. The Bachelor? Brianne? Bachelor. We'll come back to you, all right? Colleen? One of my other favorite movies is Wolf Wolf, and Wolf Wolf, he teaches you about dogs and how you train them and how they're going to go potty in your house and whatever. All that? Okay, Jack? I like Star Wars. Yeah, that's a good one. AJ? Alex? My favorite movie is The Mummy. The Mummy? Lauren? My favorite movie is Stuart Little, My Favorite Marshall, and um, Toy Story 2. Great. down there? Look at the camera. Where's your paper? Up on the desk? Cool. 
Hi, Mrs. Mucka. What are you writing about, Reed? Superheroes about me. Only me. You and the superheroes? Yeah. Cool. Can I see it? Pretty cool. Good job, Reed. David, what are you working on? Um, I'm working on the uh, track of an optical illusion. It's the train track that's the optical illusion. Here's where the sky meets the land, and then here's the railroad track. And it's going up. How did you learn about optical illusions? On a shop. Cool. Only this is quick going to invent, Reed? I'm going to invent what's called uh, the blast the skier. What is it? You ski and those and some blast and some rockets uh, and your skis and you go here. Yeah. That'd be fun. That'd be fun. Yeah. I'm writing um, about a movie named um, It. I am writing a movie named It. Mm -hmm. What are you writing about? I'm writing about um, Mrs. Bucket and a monster. And a monster? <laughs> You're not trying to scare your teacher, are you? What are you writing about? Um, me and Jessica are doing turtle warriors. And we're making no, we're making turtle and froggy warriors. And yeah. They're going to be in a war and the uh, froggy's going to go, and half of the turtle's going to go, who's going to And then he's going to, he's going to, he's going to go, and then he's going to go, and then he's going to go, and I'm just using my imagination for this. Just your imagination? I think yeah. that's a good thing to use. Pretty cool. Well, I'm just getting started. I'm going to write about um, fossils. Er, I might write about dinosaurs. And I write about different kinds and small ones and strong ones and fast ones. Is it going to be like non-fiction, like all different facts about them? It's going to be kind of a fake story. Oh, okay. Like some of the dinosaurs talk. Great. Can't wait to see you. What are you writing about, Jenna? Uh, she's doing spooky things. Can I see, Lauren? What are you writing about, Lauren? Spooky things. Can I see? Scary things. Can you show me your first page? So you're doing your illustrations first? Yeah, I'm coloring, I'm drawing, and then I'm writing. Oh, wow. What are you doing, Jenna? Wait, 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 hold on. I'm going to zoom in. Do you want to read one of them for us? You don't want to? Okay, I'll do one. Um, I'll do... Okay, Nancy sat next to a nerd named Ned. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Here's, um, this is how it goes. You went upstairs. Who is that? Here's you. Oh. You go in, you open the door, and then you went upstairs in the bedroom. You open the door, you hear, you hear goo ga, then you hear goo, 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 and then some, a monster jumped out. You scared? He had to take the garbage out, and then, um, you hug. And then, then they were still um, at the house packing. And then she went downstairs to do the laundry. And there was the mom. And she fell down. And then there's the truck. And then in the new house, she go upstairs. There's the monster, monster still up there. And then here's the other truck. Here's you. 
Singers or groups or things like that. And who do you like? Britney Spears. Kevin? Um, Smash Adam? Um, Brian? Bri Bri Hoku. Hoku? Ooh, interesting. Molly? Hoku, Bastion Boys, and Sing 90 Degrees, Britney Spears, and Hanson. Hanson? Shannon? Um, I like, um, Backstreet Boys and Smash Mouth and Britney Spears. Yeah? Who do you like? Um, 
I like um, Billy Spears and the Backstreet Boys. Yeah. Um, I like um, Ricky Martin. Ricky Martin? Yeah. Um, Smash Mouth. Um, what else? I forgot that one song that I forgot its name. Okay, if you think about it, we'll come back to you, no, okay? No, I, I, I don't know the one you said. Um, I, I like the Black City Boys a little bit, and uh, I like 90 Degrees and NSYNC. Very good. Okay, Jack? The Beatles? I remember yeah. the Beatles. Jessica? Uh, I like Eiffel 65, Backstreet Boys, and Britney Spears. Very good. David? I like Backstreet Boys. Alex? Smash Mouth. Jenna? I like um, Jeannie in a Bottle. Yeah? Jeannie in a Bottle by Christina Aguilera? I know that song. Yeah? Is that who sings it? Yeah. yeah. It's Reed, who do you like? I played up the song in the Fuzzy Family. I get these uh, monkeys and uh, my favorite animals, and I made up the song. You want to sing it for us? No, and the, and the band is called The Monks. Okay. Who do you like, Michael? Um, Buddy Guy and Kenny Blue Ray, they're both famous blues players. Wow, great. You like blues music? Mm -hmm. And both of them, um, Kenny Blue, or I mean, Buddy Guy plays a guitar, and Kenny Blue Ray, I think, plays a trumpet. Yeah. Neat. That's interesting. Jarrett? I like the Vague Boys. Oh, I couldn't hear you. Who? I like the Vague Boys and Shania Twain. And the song that means Charlie. You want to sing it for us? No. No? no? What's the name of the song you made up? Um. <laughs> I don't know. What is the song? It's called If You Want to Be a Pokemon Nest. You won't sing it for us? Okay, Colleen, who do you like? Um, I like Britney Spears, Backstreet Boys, and I like Ricky Martin. Okay. Elizabeth, who do you like? Um, I like Christina, Christina Aguilera, um, Britney Spears, and Backstreet Boys. Okay. Who do you like, Adrian? The Rolling Stones. Yeah, the Rolling Stones. Is there anyone that hasn't shared yet? If you've already shared, put your hand down, please. Lauren? Charlie, who do you like? The Beach Boys. Cool. AJ? Wait a minute. Yeah, what kind of hip hop? Is that a kind of music? Yeah. Yeah? I don't know what his name is. Okay. Number five. I just forgot that ah. one. Okay. Come say our favorite TV shows. Kevin, what's yours? Um, yeah. Rugrats. Rugrats? Any Shots. What is it? Um, Any Shots. Okay. Lauren? Um, Home on Lucas. Jarrett? Um, National Geographic. Okay. I like watching... Um, stuff on, um, on monkeys and baboons and where they live mm -hmm. and how they eat and how they turn Okay. AJ? Um, I like, uh, Pokemon. Rian? I like Pokemon. Okay. And? Um, I like, I like Pokemon, Cow and Chicken, and Pokemon. Cow and chick Chicken? Yeah, Michael. On uh, Nickelodeon, my favorite show is Keenan and Cal. On and on tape, my favorite movie is Chip and Dale.
Great, Charlie? I'm um, Franklin. Yeah? Adrian? Wrestling. Wrestling? Really? <laughs> cool. Elizabeth? Um, my favorite show is Disney. Anything on Disney? Um, <coughs> all the stuff. Okay, cool. Andrea? Um, my, I got two. I'm King Kel and I'm Buffy the Vampire. Okay. Andrew? Um, I like King and the Cow all that. Um, Ed and Eddie is on Cartoon Network and I like South Park. And You're allowed to watch South Park? No, I like it though. I play South Park King Ball. Okay. And I like and I movie I like um I like two movies from the, um, I mean three movies from the movie theater. Great. What are they? Um, I mean four. Stuart Little's Toy Story 2, Voice into Newman, and um, Pokemon the first movie. Great. Thanks, Andrew. Uh, um, my favorite shows are anything on Nickelodeon, Franklin, and Disney, and um, we got the other one. We'll think about it, okay? Molly? Um, I like... Rink, Rugrats, and so weird. Just one more. One more? It was called, um, it was this one show, it was the Babysitter's Club, and, um, it was this, um, one about the, this girl. Wasn't the Horse Whisperer, but it was like the Horse Whisperer. Okay. Jessica? Um, my favorite shows are Everything I did. Okay. Who's that? Anyone else? Reed, what's your favorite TV show? I didn't make up, I didn't tell you my song. You want to do it? Yeah. Okay. But not say the whole song. Hold on a second. Reed's going to tell us his, his song. I made up this one, and it's called The Front Sweet Monks. You want to sing it for us? No. No! Please! Please! I don't know how to sing it yet. You want to say it? Okay. You keep practicing, all right? Okay. Shannon? Or you already shared, Shannon. Will you? I remember you said you come back to me. Yeah. My favorite, um, my other favorite show is All That and The Baby Stars Club. Great. Thanks. Say anything you want. You pass? You change your mind? Yep. Okay. You want to just tell your name? Yeah. Yeah? AJ. AJ? Yeah, AJ Williams. Um, you want to tell about your chick? Mm -hmm. No? Okay. Well, um, for my kids, um, I would want to say that if you want to be a good student and kid in class, and you have to listen, and if the teacher says to do something like, just go help your friends clean up, or go and see if they're okay, do something nice or something that the teacher told you to do. That's good advice. You do that, don't you? Yeah. Anything else you'd like to tell about yourself? Well, I would want to tell my kids that if they ever like get in trouble for like doing something, I would tell them to try to do better next time. Very good. Thank you, Molly. Well, Thanks. Um, a little bit. Okay. What would you say? Um. I want my kids to um be nice to other people and yeah. like do what they're supposed to do when I ask them to do their homework and um I ask them to you know, like sometimes help help the people that have to get their homework done um like help at math meeting when they're the work on their pages when the teacher talks and tells them that you can go help people. Very good. Very good advice. Anything else you'd like to share about yourself? Um, I'm really nice and if I do my homework at home my mom and dad told me to and I play with my friends a lot and I help and check people out. Very good. Thank you, Andrew. Anything else? Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. Do you have any advice for your children? If you could tell them something? No? What should they do in school? Be good. 
Yeah, what else? You don't know, is there anything else you'd like to share about yourself? Things that you like to do? No? Okay, thank you. Okay, Charlie, what would you like to share? If you could give advice to someone or your children even, what would you tell them in school they need to do? Do you want to tell us about yourself? Anything more about yourself? What do you like to do and things like that? No? Do you collect anything? Yeah? What? Yeah? Why are they so cool, do you think? Oh, I'm sort of getting not used to that anymore because I used to be used. I used to have a useful thing, and now I sort of don't like Pokemon cards. Yeah, how come? Because they don't look like new. Like, they, they're like, the first card I ever saw was mine. The Charmander that I saw. I opened up my first pack, and then I saw a Charmander, and the, in that first pack that I got, they're all mysterious. First edition, and then I found the first edition Charizard, and then when I was born on my bike, I lost it. Oh no. He is expensive, $203. Oh my goodness. That's disappointing, isn't it? But one of my, one of my, like, my mom's, um, my mom's grass cutter. He found it in somebody's house and then he picked it up and then he brought it to his house and that and he saw it. It was a Charizard and he, and my dad thinks it's first edition or not first edition. And Ryan, his name is Ryan and he said it's first edition and that's mine and he's gonna give me it back when he finds it. Wow, that's good. Lucky that he found it. Would you like to share anything else? No? Okay. Thank you. That's okay. Um, come and come out first. Wait, Shannon, come back, come back, come back. You want to take me? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Shannon, if you could give any advice or words of wisdom to your kids about how to be good in school, what would you tell them? I don't know. You don't know how to be good? No. That's not true. Um, don't be shy. I'm thinking. You're thinking? All right. Kids that are for the future, I would say don't talk in class or you, or you might ruin your time or something. Get in trouble? Yeah, get in trouble. Yeah, wait, wait, come back. Is there anything more you'd like to tell us about yourself? Things that you do, what you like at, to do? At home, I like to watch TV a lot. When I get home from school, I usually um do, I usually have a um, snack and then I play a little bit with my minis or something and then I go and then I go and watch TV and like yeah. I do that a lot. Do you play any instruments? Um I can play bass a little bit and um drums and piano. Piano? Yeah what are some songs you know how to play? Yankee Doodle, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star and Pop Rose Very good. Anything else you'd like to add? Nope. Okay, thank you. When I got home from school, I, um, I, um, I usually um, change my clothes and I have a snack, but sometimes I just leave my school clothes on, and um, I play, and I, and I watch TV sometimes, or I do my homework, and then I always have, and I have dinner um, a, couple hour, a couple hours later when I get home from school, and, um, my mom's a mom that stays home and just watches my brothers. Yeah. Anything else? No. Okay. So tell us about yourself that you haven't been able to yet. Uh, no. No? What kind of things do you like to do, Reed? Play with my monkeys all day, my stuffed monkeys. 
They're called the fuzzy family. Yeah, how do you what? what do you do? What? What do you do with them? What do I do with them? Uh, they walk around and talk, and and they talk like this. Hi, Ren. Hi, Reed. How are you doing today? Cool. So then what else do you do? Um, I have to tell you something else. What? This one fuzzy family, he's a king and his name is Fuzzy. Yeah? Yeah. How did he get to be king? I, he's really old and I, and that was the first monkey I got and he's a king monkey. Very That's good. why I got yeah. Anything else you want to share? Uh, anything else is Amber. She's a queen. Yeah? Yeah. She's a girl. Wow, that's neat. I'm fuzzy. I'm Amber. Neat. Anything else? Um, if you could tell the future generations of kids, maybe even your kids, what they had to do to be good in school, what would you tell them? Uh, uh, no clue. You don't know? No. What do you do to be good in school? Uh, I be quiet and try to be good. Yeah? You do all your work? Yep. Yep. Okay, Reed, thank you. Is there anything you'd like to tell us about um, yourself? I You what? I wrestle with my dog. Oh yeah? Who wins? My dog. <laughs> What's your dog's name? Molly. Yeah? Anything else? Um, she's a golden receiver. Yeah? Uh, and um, um, that he used to have a dog named Peaches. And she, um, I was the baby when we had Peaches. Yeah. If you could give advice to children of the future, what would you tell them? You don't know? What do they need to do in school? How? Very good. Thank you, Jenna. Anything else? If you could give advice to children of the future, what would you tell them? Like about school or how to be a good kid? How to be a good kid is listen to your parents and don't do anything they don't say. Don't do anything they don't say? Is that what you said? Yeah. And first you got to Anything else, Colleen? Can you think of anything? I can't. I think you did a really good job. Did I say that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Girls, tell us what you... My dad, his name was Tim, he passed away. Um, he had a motorcycle.
Your dad? Yeah. Okay. And if you see a seven on the um, TV, that means that uh, my dad died. Yeah. Anything else, girls? Yeah. And then we have a vehicle. He put his motorcycle and his seats and all his stuff. Yeah. And my mom's um, dad, when he died, um, he, he had a heart attack. So how he died? He had a heart attack, and, um, but he wanted to be flowing into the ocean. Okay. Um, we, we, the room that Andy was talking about, my dad, whoever wants to do it, my mom made it to checkerboard, and my mom, my mom made it, and it took uh, um, two days to make it because it's really expensive. Whoever wants to see my dad and they're going to cry, they um, shut the doors and they cry and nobody gets to see Yeah. Do you girls go in there? And I cry a lot. But my dear one, there was a, um, I, there was a, there was a washing machine, washing machine, and did I do with it? So my dear one, it kept all the way in the tube. Anything else? No, I don't know what to talk about. No? If you could give advice to the kids of the future, what would you tell them? Um, to try hard for school and um, have fun. Yeah? Tell me about your family. Um, I got a mom, a dad, and two sisters. What are they like? Um, here, read this book. My sisters, they're okay. Yeah? Just okay? Yeah. Do they pester you? Kind of. Yeah? Do you love them? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What kind of things do you do together? Um, we play hockey. Um, we play house. Okay, anything else you want to add? Okay, thank you. How come you're in that costume? I just met his sisters and I, and I met drama. What, have you, what are you acting out in drama? Well, me and Anne Marie are playing a game. What game? Well, she's, she's like, I'm like the taxi cab driver and I drive her around the world. And I like get in different costumes for start my husband. And then I'm the taxi cab driver. This is the husband suit. Cool. Looking pretty sharp. What else? Tell me more about yourself, Michael. Well, I have blonde hair. Uh, I have a couple friends. Uh, Kenley and Elizabeth. Uh, that's it. Yeah? You could give advice to the future. What would you tell them about how to be a good student or a good kid? Not to boss people around and not to hit and punch. That's good advice. Anything else? No? Anything else you want to tell? No? Thank you. It's like that. What? How come you're dressed like that? Uh, 
Who are you playing with? Michael and Elizabeth and Charlie. How do you play that? We just pretend we're like, um, like I'm the mom and Michael, and we just um, pick who's who, and then we just like pretend it's like. Fun. That sounds like fun. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us more about yourself, Anne? Is there anything you want to tell? Well, I hope everyone, all my kids, to be good students. You want to be a teacher when you grow up? Yeah. Yeah. Great. Anything else? No. No? How do you be a good student? I just follow directions. Yeah. I try not to be bad. Good. Is that it? Great. This is Mrs. Garcia's class. Well, we, we are doing center designers at math, so I'm doing, I'm making, like, I'm counting how much blocks there are right now. Making how much, I'm counting how much rubber bands. Cool, that sounds like fun. Jack, you want to tell about a little bit more about yourself? Yeah. Um, what I really like to do is draw because my dad's an artist, and I love to read and draw a book. Yeah. Uh -huh. Tell me about your mom. Well, my mom, she's a, she helps people on phones. She's like a like a phone. She like if the phone breaks, she makes it. She could help it bend. What does she help you with? She helps me with is trying to draw and, and math. Yeah. Anything else? No. No. Um, if you could give advice to future kids, students, what would you tell them? Oh, uh, tell them, like, like, 10 minus 10, so it's like 10 minus 10, so like 10 piles, so what, 10 piles equals 20, so it'd be 10 minus 10 would be 20. 10 minus 10 or 10 plus 10? 10 plus 10. Yep, you got it. Good. That would be a good way to teach it, wouldn't it? Does your mom help you learn that way? Yeah, that's pretty good. What else? Anything? Um, no, not really, but I can tell her some more about math. Okay, tell us. Um, nine. Okay. Wait. 10 plus 10 would be, um, no, 10 plus 9 would be, oh yeah, um, um, what's it called again? Number 19, and that's all I can tell you about that right now. Okay, thank you. I like to play with Pokemon, and my puppy, I, um, she ripped up one of my Pokemon cards, and I got a little mad. But when she did, I, I got, I got happy again because my, um, she gave, she, she was, she put her head down and she went to the, um, she went to her dog box and she got a bone for me. Ah, that's sweet. What was your dog's name? Chansey. Yeah. What'd you name her after? After she died, right? No, no. What did, didn't you name her after something? A Pokemon. A Pokemon. Yeah. Anything else, Jared? If you could tell kids of the future how to be good or something like that, what would you tell them? I would tell them to um, watch your teacher make to make to not do bad things. Okay. Sounds like good advice. Anything else? No. Okay, thank you. My name's Elizabeth, and I have a golden retriever named Samantha. And um, she is 10 years old, and I have a baby brother, which is a pest. <laughs> and um, 
I got some advice for you. The advice is um, always be good and listen to what the teacher has to say and follow directions. Great advice. Anything else you want to tell about? Nope. No? Okay. Um, my favorite TV show is National Geographic and any other show that um, talks about human cultures. And I like um, human cultures because um, I like learning how people speak and what cultures they live in and how much it's changed since the early life. Like one show I watched, and one National Geographic I watched, it talked about th there was this one culture th that um, anyway, even if there was no Y2K, nothing could happen to them because um, they had, they didn't, they are still living like Indians. You could give advice to kids um, in the future. What would you tell them? I tell them to read lots of history books. Read lots of history. You like history, don't you? Great. Right. Anything else? The TV show is Rugrats, Rocket Power, and Yeah. If I give advice, write and sound out words before you say them. What was that? One more time. I give advice and I say sound out words and try not to say first and you don't know that word. Anything more you want to tell about yourself? No? No? You have any pets? I have a dog named Mason. I used to have a dog named Regis. Yeah. Great. See, I, I'm your mother's children. And I was born in 1992. And, and did you know, as you're growing up, that you know that 2 plus 2 equals 4? And I'm right now sitting in a math chair, and I'm the math teacher. Can you see? Okay. Yeah. My teacher is camcording, and she always has a ring around her, her eye. So she laughs, and she says, don't you think it's pretty? It's Why do I have a ring around my eye, Jessica? Um, she's camcording, and there's some rubber around her eye. And camcording is very hard for you children, very hard. I was I can't code it and um and I can't put it perfect because we have this one camp quarter thing and you open it and there's this movie thing right here and um, you can watch it that way and you hold it and um my grand my my mommy daddy um he had a stroke and he had his brain died which is his language brain and so he has to talk like this I'm gonna be yeah. and um I will see you when you are born. And, uh, 8 plus 8 equals 16, and 14 plus 14, I don't know what it equals because I can't manage it right now. Um, 6 plus 6 equals 12, and, um, uh, and Mrs. Greco is wearing a purple shirt. And I am wearing a vest, which is in the classroom today. And, um, can I think of Mrs. Greco? And I'm wearing black, and I'm wearing bell bottoms, and look, my new sh tennis shoes and white, and um, Finish up. And there's a red light beeping at me, and there's a microphone. Say bye-bye. And bye-bye, uh, children.